Good morning, YouTube. JR Revolution. And this one again with another fucking awesome video blog. Okay. Today. This blog today is about yeah. niggas that think you're stupid. Yeah. Um. I don't understand why some of these motherfucking niggas out here think they can just manipulate you and lie to you and do shit and they think that it's a secret, like they're getting away with it. They're like, yeah, they all over me. She ain't never gonna find this shit out because I'm too smooth. No, the fuck, you're not. You're actually really dumb, and you start to show that you're doing shit because you're stupid. And, like, don't act like I don't know you not doing you. You're doing you, boo. I know you're doing you, boo. Don't lie and act like you ain't doing you, boo, boo. Because you is doing you, and I know it. I know it, and I can't know it, and I know it, but I know that, and I know you. So it's like... Come on, and then long distance relationships. For real, come on, y'all. It's 2009. If you're talking to somebody or in a relationship with somebody that just moved far, far, far away, living with Shrek and Donkey and all them, do not. Okay, I repeat. Do not. Think for one second they're not doing them. Don't think they're not doing them, okay? Because they are doing them. Don't think they're not doing them. Just don't. I can't stand when niggas. I can't stand when. I can't stand when niggas think you're stupid. It's like you get caught like this is my friend. The other day, in fact, this morning, I get a phone call early in the morning. My homeboy asked me to call the chat line and see if see if this guy he's talking to is one. So, I'm like, I don't want to, like, please, can you do it for me? I call. I make a funny, I change my voice up and shit, I'm fucking part of all war and all that shit. And he's on there. And just to, for reassurance, I ask him, where are you calling from? And he tells me. So I hang up. And I call my friend and call the chat line again, you know, pretty way. And he talks to him the time with a different voice and everything. And he's talking to him, so he hangs up and, you know, calls him and shit. And he's like, would you lie to me? And he's like, no. He's like, are you sure? He's like, yes, I will never lie to you. I can't lie to you. Mind you, when he first got on the phone, he asked him what he was doing, he said nothing. And he was scared. So, he's like, okay. So, since you say that, I'm going to ask you this. And if you don't tell me the truth, what should I think? He's like, well, if I don't tell you the truth, then you think I'm a big, fat ass liar. He says, okay. And he goes, Are you on the chat line this morning? Breathe. Yes. Yeah. My friend's like, Why? Why are you on the chat line? And he's trying to understand it. Like, Why are you. He's like, Because I didn't have anybody to talk to. He's like, Okay, well, I called you exactly an hour, 30 minutes ago. So, why don't you just call me back? You had to look at your phone and say that I called you. Because Oh, he didn't know the guy called and he says, um, in fact, my mother told me that you called, and my friend's like, but she just told me a minute ago you didn't know I called. So my friend starts to get upset, and he starts to cry a little bit, but he doesn't show it on the phone. I'm like, yes, be strong, bitch, I'm here for you, I'm on the other line with the phone, and he's like, yes, be strong, and this nigga's trying his best to lie his way out of the situation. 
and it hurts me. It hurts me real much. It, ho- it hurts me a whole lot because I hate guys that say just to people. Like, oh, I'm he's in love with me so much. No, no boo boo. One thing me and my friends are good at, okay, is having intelligence. We are not dumb, and we are not stupid, and we're not easily manipulated at all. You cannot conjure any deceptive whatevers to try to get us and manipulate us to do shit that you want us to do because we're not dumb. You're not stupid. We've been in a relationship for a long time. We've had a lot of heartbreak. And this is what they should happen to us. So, basically, what I'm saying is, um, niggas, I think you so great and you can make niggas fall in love with your ass and all kinds of other things. Let it go. Let it go. Because when your motherfucking ass is caught, then y'all be like, nigga, 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 nigga. Like, y'all don't, y'all, y'all just get retarded. You forget all about what's up here. Just like, nigga, like, nigga. You don't know shit. You're just stupid. So, stop playing games, y'all. Dumb niggas, let it go. Let this shit go. And for those of you out there who are easily manipulated, break your ass out of that. Because every if you're if, if you're easy to manipulate, you're never going to be happy because people just want to keep playing with your emotions and pissing you the fuck off. And you only realize after the situation is over that damn I was real stupid. So just let it go. Stop it. I love all y'all. Thank you, YouTube.